Okay. Good morning, Doctor. We are from Group 12 of Section 21. This is our group project of our video presentation. Next. Our group member consists of four members, which is Muhammad Asli bin Karmarudin, me, myself, Amishan, Muhammad Humaydi bin Chukrifi, and Jogan Lee Raihi. Next. So the first program we are going to talk about is the first year experience uh, program organized by Faculty of Mechanical Engineering on 2nd, 22nd November 2022 at Block N24 Derwang Ulia 7. Next. So uh, the background of the program, first year experience FYE event are organized by the Mechanical Engineering Student Association, MESA, along with other collaborating clubs and the Faculty of Mechanical Engineering, FKM, is to allow first-year students to familiarize with university life and academic preparation. The event is also aimed to help new students get used to college life and give them the skills and information they would need for their academic journey. The FYV event included the particip participation of several student clubs, including SAE, Technomarine, IEC, IMM, SME, and Aero. <coughs> this setting up booth, each club setting up booth to provide information about their respective clubs and activity. Next. So there are four objectives to the program. The first is to provide knowledge about university system and resources. The next is facilitating adaptation to campus life and building resilience. The third one is instilling a spirit of learning and leadership to the first year students. And the finally is establishing connection among students and university members. Thanks. So this is our the tentative of the program. The total participant is approximately 200 people, including speakers, committees, and students. So the <clears throat> event starts by student registration at 1.30 p.m. and then opening remarks at 2 p.m. Uh, there, are, uh, there are seven slots to the program, which include uh, FY Care, UTM Support System, UTM Graduate Attributes, uh, semester system, academic advisory and academic regulation, learning skill and introduction to BMIIM. Lastly, when the talk is over, the student will be ha having a closing ceremony and we they will have uh, go to the FKM club booth, which have the showca showcase of MESA, SAE, Technomarine, IEC, IMM, SME and Aero, Aero clubs. They will be dismissed at uh, 7 p.m. Next. So what is group through of the program? The first year student will gain more knowledge about the semester system of the course. And the learn, they will learn the skill, uh, learning skill during their course of study in UK. FYE give exposure to the first year student of mechanical engineering about the first year. Uh, FYE also gave campus adaptation, resilience and environment. The first year student will acquire knowledge about the support system and graduate attribute in UK. They also instill the spirit of learning and leadership as well as establishing new and stronger connection between all members of UK. Next to is to understand about academic adversary and academic regulation. Lastly, FYE students are introduced and involved with BMIIM. So I'll be passing it to my Next presenter, which is Jordan Lee. So what can be improved from this event? So basically this event uh, can counter the problem, which is lacking of publications regarding the events and clashes with the classes for the students. So there are three solutions that are suggested for this event organizer, which is to provide information about the events before the event starts, publicize the event using all UTM official social media account, Make the event compulsory to all faculty of mechanical engineering students, as well as setting the day of event in weekend to avoid clashes with the classes. 
so in in terms of low attendance for the event is that not all not all of the first year mechanical students attended the program so similarly for the so solutions and suggestions for this uh issue will be to increase the number of participants in future FIE programs. To do this, uh, the event organizer can offer diverse activities to make it more interesting for the students by providing interactive activities to promote engagement among the participants such as quizzes, as well as having a reward for participating. So persons who can uh, correctly answer the quiz the most will be awarded and as well as providing taught back for attending the program itself. So for the students who are not available to attend, they can uh, attend the program using on uh, Facebook and Webex, which is online, so that they are more flexible to the program. And for the publication wise, the event organizer can provide a wide publication of the event early on to catch the first year students' interest. So for invitations, they can use emails or messenger apps such as WhatsApp and Telegram to send the invitation. So as for the conclusion of this uh, event in particular, is that this event was a great opportunity for the first year mechanical engineering students to clear the doubts and uncertainty that they have in them about the, the courses, about UTM, and as well as the future. So it was a great bonding experience between the lecturers and the students throughout the event. And it's certain that the students are able to enjoy their university life after this event. Okay, move on to the next event is HSE, which is Heart Safety Environment in University, held by Sharikat Ayi This is this event held in Faculty of Mechanical Engineering at DK1 E07 on June 11, 2024. Next slide. So the background of the event, FKM in collaboration with Sharikat Ayah Selangor organizing an SCR program related to occupational safety, health and the environment. This program, students will have the opportunity to gain direct knowledge and experience from the industry professional, as well as participate in the sport the hazard competition, which will be guided by SAS staff as facilitators. Students, students will be excused from lecture, lectures on that day, provided with me and all participants will receive a certificate of participation signed by FKM and SAS. Additionally, there will be opportunity to win individual and group prizes. Next slide. There are three objectives in this event. Uh, firstly, students will be given opportunities and knowledge directly from the industry. Second objective is to participate in the sport, the hazard competition. And lastly, providing exposure related to the basic health and safety environment requirement in the workplace to the student, especially final year students who are about to enter their workforce. Next. These are the tentative of the program. So the approximately 200 people participate in this event, including speaker, committees, and students. The program start with a registration at 8 a.m. and then continue with the two learning module for that support the hazard activity presentation, quizzes, and award presentation. And lastly, close with afternoon tea at 5 p.m. The next slide, I will pass to Umaydi. But it's good throughout the program. 
First is student gains a comprehensive understanding of health, safety and environmental issue, preparing them to recognize and address potential hazard in the workplace. HSE program teach critical skills such as risk assessment, emergency response and safe work practice, which are applicable in various professional settings. And third is students de develop a sense of responsibility and a protective mindset towards their own health and safety, as well as that of others around them. HSE programs often include leadership and management training, helping students develop into well-rounded professional who can lead safety initiative. Next. What can be improved in the program? And the problem encountered during the program is limited to only mechanical industry student. Uh, only the target participant is present in the program and that leads to low publication towards the other mechanical engineering branch student. And the solution and suggestion is make it a compulsory program for all third or fourth year students to attend. Next. And the content of the program first is lecture. The lecture should add more on real life application and gimmick to make it more understandable. And the second is activity. Other than spot the hazard, the activities should be add more. For example, acting or sharing experience. And the last is time. Time management should be improved since there is some delay on each activity or extend the duration of the program to add more activities. Next. And for and as the conclusion, the program organized by FKM in collaboration with Syarikat AIS Lango aims to provide students with invaluable industry knowledge and practical experience. By participating in this sport the hazard competition, and engaging directly with Syarikat AIS Lango professional, students will gain critical insight into occupational safety, health and environmental practice. This initiative is particularly beneficial for final year students as it, as it equips them with essential HSE knowledge and preparing them for a successful transition into the workforce. Next. And that's all for our for group 12. Thanks for the watching. Thank you.